Hello, Jane. Good morning to you. Good important update from the Eurozone. Of course, jitters still there. Portugal's been trying to borrow money this morning with some mixed results. Yes, Portugal uh, borrowed money from investors uh, this morning in a one-year bond auction. The bonds were oversubscribed, but the government had to offer interest rates of 5.3%. Now, that's up from 4.8% a fortnight ago and up from 2.8% a year ago. In fact, just think what you can personally borrow money at to buy a house. Well, congratulations, you're a better bet than the government at Portugal and Greece and Ireland at the moment. Well, Megan Green is from the Economist Intelligence Unit and joins me now. Good morning uh, to you, Megan. Um, how far away are we from a Portuguese bailout? How far away is Portugal from what the state has felt Ireland? Yeah, not far at all. I think that Portugal is right on Ireland's heels in requesting access to a lending facility. And I think um, investors seem to think this as well because They've largely sort of glossed over Portugal as a done deal for needing a bailout and are um, quickly looking towards Spain and Italy now. Now, there's been some talk that uh, what the Portuguese banks have been doing is actually borrowing money from the ECB to buy its own government bonds. And so what the ECB has been doing is effectively lending money directly to the Portuguese government. 